Welcome to our video on the legality of requiring employees to wear shock collars as a means to increase their productivity. Though controversial, recent changes to national and local labor laws have opened up several loopholes which make the viability of forcing your employees to wear an electrical productivity enhancement device both advantageous to your performance goals but also lower the risk of a class action lawsuit or other litigation as well. Shock collars are electronic devices designed to deliver electric shocks to the wearer. Primarily used in pet training, they are now being considered for workplace applications as a productivity tool. Recent tests conducted in our research facility in Southeast Asia have shown an almost 60% increase in not only productivity metrics, but also a compliance factor increase of nearly 90%. The victims, uh, I mean test subjects, were much more willing to do mundane tasks and almost never complained about their pay rate, which was basically just one or two handfuls of rice a day. Requiring employees to wear shock collars raises significant ethical questions and may infringe upon their rights to a safe and respectful work environment. Laws and regulations regarding employee rights and workplace safety must be carefully considered. That is why we have initiated new guidelines to oversee their use and have included a packet with reading materials, adhesive reminder notes, first aid kit, and a large poster to help in the proper use of the collars and to curb overuse. Some have advised that rather than resorting to extreme measures like shock collars, companies can focus on creating supportive work cultures, implementing effective incentives, and providing proper training and development opportunities to enhance employee productivity. However, our board of directors thought otherwise and preferred to just shock the hell out of any employee who chooses to be lazy, uncompliant, sick, or just a jerk, and in so doing might just instill a little incentive in that person to be nicer and more productive, as well as being a bit more grateful that they have a job in the first place. Implementation should be made easier by following these helpful suggestions. Remind your employees that the collars come in several colors and styles, are comfortable to wear, and rather fashionable. Advise them that the collars are part of much larger goal-oriented corporate philosophy. Emphasize that the use of the collar is only due to their personal failures and should be seen as a form of encouragement for them to strive to be better employees. With the supplemental materials provided and continued monitoring of their implementation by our new Overlord Department, the introduction of our electrical productivity enhancement devices should be a huge success and culminate with increased profits, increased bonuses, and advancement opportunities for middle management stooges throughout the company. We hope you found this seminar helpful and will now stand and join us in saying, all hail our great and powerful executive president for his financial genius and his everlasting compassion for us underlings. Blessings and glory be unto the board of directors. Thank you.